In July this year, the Speaker of Parliament, who doubles as Reverend Minister Professor Michael Quay, warned officials of Amnesty International that leaders in countries like Ghana would not concede to the insistent push by external forces to accept acts such as homosexuality, bestiality, among others. A stance the Asin South MP, Reverend John Intim Fodjo, who doubles as Chairman of Ghana Canada Parliamentary Friendship Association, supports. He is not happy with a call by members of an advocacy group who sought to convert support from certain powerful persons and institutions in Canada to put pressure on Ghana to okay such practices. I hereby openly and unequivocally declare my firm position against the views of the members of an advocacy group who on Thursday, August 17, 2017, sought to convert support from certain powerful persons and institutions in Canada to put pressure on Ghana to decriminalize homosexuality. In furtherance of their demonic agenda, it is alleged that a group of eight men had embarked on soliciting signatures ostensibly to put pressure on Ghana to decriminalize homosexuality. He quoted portions of Ghana's constitution and criminal code that is against such practices. He had this advice for advocates of homosexuality among others. I wish to assure any group of people or institutions, both external and internal, who may court the interest of leading and or financing the agenda of legitimizing homosexuality, lesbianism and bestiality in Ghana that their exercise will utterly fail. Let me offer them this advice. Repent, repent, and see the light of the salvation of Jesus, for Jesus loves you. He made his appeal to MPs and religious leaders. I humbly call on all members of parliament to remain resolute in, our, in defense of our constitution and resist strongly any pressure that may arise for potential compromise. Let us stand steadfast and uphold godly legislation. According to Reverend John Intim Fodjo, from the biblical perspective, homosexuality, lesbianism and bestiality are deemed abominable and forbidding.